Build a globally diversified core portfolio and keep it fully invested for the long term. There's probably no more important piece of advice for protecting your wealth and growing it over time. Combining different asset classes from around the world has long helped investors earn returns while mitigating risks. Unfortunately, achieving diversification today is more challenging than ever before. We believe this calls for certain changes to the way we perform asset allocation. Fixed income has always played a vital role in diversifying portfolios. When equities have fallen sharply, prices of the highest quality fixed income, like government bonds, have typically risen. The main rationale was their assured income that those bonds offered. Today, however, record low interest rates mean that they offer very little income. On a long-term view, therefore, we see holding such bonds as similar to holding cash. Although holding a large amount of cash helps dampen portfolio volatility, it also holds back your returns. Perhaps we could use investment grade corporate credit to diversify portfolios and earn income instead of government bonds. After all, high quality US corporate credit and US treasuries have often moved closely together in the past. Unfortunately, in periods of severe economic stress, the relationship breaks down during the period when strong fixed income performance is most needed to offset equity weakness. When equities sold off hard in early 2000, for example, high quality US credit fell too even as treasuries rose. We saw something similar during the worst of the financial crisis in 2008. So with credit moving more in line with equities in sensitive periods, we need to look for further ways to diversify. To be clear, we believe it's still important to include both government bonds and credit in core portfolios. Government bonds, like US treasuries, can still help to dampen portfolio volatility when equities fall. Our message is that we need to consider additional ways of seeking diversification. One possibility is allocation to gold, which has tended not to move in line with equities over time. However, because it pays no income, gold isn't a substitute for yield-paying diversifiers like bonds. This is where certain capital market strategies could be useful for qualified investors. When stock market volatility is high, there are strategies that seek to convert that volatility to income. When stock market volatility is low, there are strategies that enable us to buy equity hedges cheaply. We believe that replacing some bonds with these strategies could become an increasingly important part of the new asset allocation. While building globally diversified portfolios is essential, there are other disciplines we believe you should follow too. One of those disciplines is getting fully invested and staying invested for the long term in a way that reflects your risk tolerance. We see many clients who are sitting on excessive amounts of cash, waiting for the right time to invest. Others ask if they should commit their money in equal stages over time. Our long-term analysis is clear on this. Investing in one lump sum straight away has produced higher returns and higher risk-adjusted returns than market timing. So if your investments are overweight cash right now, let us help you implement the new asset allocation in your core portfolio.